I'm just so scared of just dying and still being stuck here. Like, part of me holds out hope that if I die again, I'll actually be back in the overworld, but I don't think so. A terrible fortress. Yeah, that's about right. Okay, that's a blaze spawner. I don't want anything to do with them. Crap. What is that? <gasps> that's like a portal. If that chest has obsidian in it, that's our way home. What is that? Yes! Okay. Okay. One piece of obsidian. That's all we need. Only one block of the portal is broken. Glistening melons, fire torches, flint, and a golden chest plate with blast protection. That's all we need. Oh, what are those things? Yes! Oh, crap. Oh, no. It's guarded. Our portal is guarded. I'm gonna have to kill this thing. No, no. Okay, do I have any arrows left? No, I don't. Okay. Uh, obsidian. Ugh. Flint and steel. I'm going home. I'm going home. I'm going home. Okay. Okay. What's up, everybody? Dr. Bacon of the Dragon Piece here. Back with some more Minecraft. So, last couple of episodes have been interesting. I did a couple of things off camera, as you can see. I actually, uh, well, first of all, I ran through the night and I killed a zombie with some enchanted golden armor and I got some leggings with projectile protection 3 and unbreaking 2, which is not particularly helpful, but okay. And I went ahead and I went back down into the cave that we, uh, we explored a few episodes ago and got all our diamonds from, and I got a couple more pieces of obsidian. Um, so we're back kind of where we started and then some. And I got a little bit more food. But as for what we're going to do this episode, well, the past couple of episodes and recent events as a whole have kind of changed our plans a bit. The name of this series is Lonely Adventures in Minecraft. And recent events have forced me to conclude that I am not as alone as I would like to believe. I don't know who or what this thing is. I wanted to pretend it was just in my head, just weird little dreams, if you can even call it that, sleep disturbances, whatever. But that's not an option anymore because I got a very resounding reply the portal was not supposed to break. The nether is scary, yeah, that's that's normal. The fact that I died, that's normal, but the portal breaking and the spawning in the nether are apparently not. I'm not alone here. It's a single player world, and yet, I'm not alone. So, as a result, I think I have some preparations to do. Now, I was planning on spending this episode trying to gear up, getting some, you know, making some real progress. I've been kind of tootling around, I've been taking things slow. You know, my first real step into, into the game progression was building the nether portal, and that was just kind of on a whim because I was sick and tired of having to dodge spoilers about the nether update. So I was gonna make an enchanting table and do some brewing and stuff, but there is a more pressing matter if I want to continue to survive in this world, and that is food. Almost every episode, I have to, between episodes, go off camera and go kill some animals off somewhere. And it's getting kind of out of hand. I am burning through food way too fast. So this episode, we are going to do a couple of things. First of all, we are going to make an enchantment table, and I think we're going to start with that. And we're going to try to do some enchanting. I don't have very many levels because I keep dying, um, but I have enough that I think I can get some better armor. I'm not going to get any crazy enchantments, so I'm just going to wear whatever I make. Um, I will... Should I make even new armor? No, it's not worth it. Is it worth it? Is it cheaper to enchant? I don't know. I don't remember how any of this works. I remember how the systems worked when they first were created. I remember a few changes that were made along the way, but I just I have not kept up enough with 
the updates, guys, that I, I really am lost on a lot of this stuff. So if I'm doing something crazy stupid, please, please let me know in the comments because I, I don't know any better. Do those not stack? Cra oh, crack versus polished. Okay. Um, yeah, so <laughs> on the other hand, I seem to be creating a collection of golden armor. And I was going to do brewing, and then that one I did bother to look up because I wanted to see how potion recipes had changed. And it seems I need fuel. And I think that is in the form of blaze powder. I only have one blaze rod, so I could make a brewing stand and I wouldn't be able to do anything with it. So we're going to wait on that for now. But I'm going to stop rambling and I'm going to go ahead and make an enchantment table. Because I should have done this before I ever went into the nether, to be completely honest with you guys. I just... I don't know. I just... I, it had been a few episodes since I'd done anything interesting. I thought, what the heck, let's have some fun. And I got my butt kicked by the game and otherwise. Uh, I need to actually make the book. So again, I don't know if enchanting has changed dramatically. I don't remember the rules as far as like what's cheaper and whatnot. We're just going to go with it. Um, and we will, we, will, blah, 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 blah. we will make some new tools. Now, I know book enchanting is a thing that like gets done in UHCs and stuff. I've done some like PvP stuff. But I don't actually know why. I don't know what the reasoning is there. So I'm not going to bother for now. But I will make a new set of tools. Um, actually, we'll just make a new sword. And we'll go ahead and make a new axe too. And then I think we're just going to enchant the diamond pickaxe. I don't have enough diamonds to start you know, using it just on a whim. Uh, but I may as well enchant it. And we'll just keep these. Put that away. Yeah, I, I ran to the cave at night, so I actually did have some trouble. I, would, I wasn't, like, on the verge of dying kind of trouble, but... Also, I've got a couple name suggestions for this guy. I think it was, like, Benjamin and Jefferson. Jefferson's interesting. It's a little too human, and Benjamin is, uh, by no fault of the commenter, uh, entirely too close to a name of an actual dog I once had. So that one's going to be off the table, unfortunately. But any other suggestions are welcome. Ooh, sharpness two. So, so what do these numbers mean anymore? Because I they used to mean like the the number the, like the number of levels you used, like the number on the right. But like seven, what does that mean? Because it says three lapis and three and three levels. So like these are clearly the number of levels. What what is what does that even mean? Is that like the level you have to be to do it? I don't know. Alright, sharpness 2. That's awesome. I think that's better than diamond now. Uh, let's see if we can get some protection going. Feather falling, I'm breaking now. Okay, I'm breaking, I'm breaking, I'm breaking. I'm breaking, I'm breaking, I'm breaking. And... Um, nothing useful. Uh, okay, let's try... So, axes are weapons now, and they do more damage than swords. Can you get sharpness on them? No. That's unfortunate, all right. Uh, I guess I'll take efficiency on the pickaxe. And now I think that means everything should have changed, right? No? Is that not how this works? Oh, yeah, okay, there we go, protection. If I can get full protection one, I'll be happy. And like, why is that missing? Like, I, I, I don't know how enchanting works anymore. Yeah, why can't I do that now? Protection feather falling. Come on. There we go. Protection one. There we go. Alright. Full protection one armor. Nothing to shake a stick at. I'm still not going back to the nether because I still don't think I'm ready for that. I think I need some potions before we do that. Or if not potions, at least just, I don't know, better enchantments. Because I got my butt kicked. And how much of that was the game and how much of that was something else i i don't know um but what i do know is that that was bad <laughs> so we're gonna wait on that now the other big thing i obviously need to do and it's getting night <sighs> do i sleep is the question do i dare sleep on the one hand i could learn something on the other hand it could be like Poking a bear with a stick. <sighs> no. 
Not yet. Maybe later, but not right now. All right, so the other thing we're going to do, like I said, is we are going to make a farm this episode. Um, now, what kind of farm? We're going to need a weed farm for sure, because I, I want to make animal farms, because we need animal farm. We need, uh, you know, we need meat. We need meat bad. But the other thing is, I, I've never, I haven't found a, a, uh, whatchamacallit, I haven't found a village. So I don't have any carrots, so I can't farm pigs. Now, cows are just better, but I'm not sure I have two cows within a reasonable distance. You know what we could do? We could do some fighting right now. That's not a bad idea. We could, we could try out our new armor. Actually, you know what? No, screw the new armor. We're just gonna, we're just gonna use our old stuff. We're gonna save the new stuff. We're gonna wear down our old gear and we're gonna get some more levels so we can make better stuff. I know you need like bookshelves and stuff to get higher enchantments and all, and all that. I, I, I know the basic idea. Can you enchant shields? No. Well, hold on, maybe. I don't remember if you need the lapis to see the enchantment options or not. No, you cannot. That'd be cool if you could. Although I guess I don't really know how a shield gets better other than unbreaking, which could be a little overpowered. All right, let's do some killing, shall we? I know I do. I do have two dungeons not far, so if I want to make XP farms out of those, I might. I'm not usually the farm building type. Like I usually, you know, I don't tend to make like iron farms and gold farms and all that kind of stuff. Um, but XP farms, I think, are are reasonable. Just because it's just kind of a pain. Uh, everything has enchanted gear. I don't know what that's about. Is that a difficulty rating? Because like I've noticed that's that seems to be unusually common now. Oh, oh dear, oh dear. That's a lot of zombies. The portal is still open, which is a good sign. It hasn't been you know, broken again, although it seems to only break when I'm inside, which is interesting. Although, that does make me realize I <laughs> traveled all the way to that cave. What is that sound? Ah! Oh, crap! That did a lot of damage. Okay. Oh, jeez. I vaguely remember those. Ooh, 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 okay. This may have been a bad idea. I vaguely remember those, like the the drowned. I ran into them a couple times when I was playing single player since at the ocean update, but I don't think I've ever saw the the uh, trident throwing outside of the water. Okay, this is this is this is actually getting pretty bad. And that did a lot of damage. Did he... Oh, oh, okay. I think the other. I think one of the other zombies killed him because he hit the other zombie. Yeah, look at this. Look at all this enchanted gear they have. What's that about? Maybe I should have worn my my good stuff. And so far, I haven't even made back what I used to get it, so it probably would not have been worth it. But. Be careful I don't back into a creeper. This is what a sword is good for. It does basically no damage on the swipe, but it keeps him at bay. We are getting... A, they're dropping a lot of it, too. That's the other weird thing. Yeah, gold leggings and a shovel. Okay, we survived that. I thought for a second we weren't going to. Alright, come on. Alright, what else is going to spawn? I guess while we do this, while we wait, we can go ahead and start. So this is where I want to make my farm. I want to make it on this kind of like flat land over here. So we're going to start with a wheat farm and then we'll expand. We're going to go ahead and trap those two cows and then we'll, we'll just, we'll give them a small pen for now. So we'll start with a wheat farm and a cow farm. Because as long as we have leather meat and and something to breed the cows, um, then we're good. All right, uh, here we go. No, 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 no! Oh, come on! Yeah. Dang it! 
and blow a hole in my beautiful field. Here's zombie. There you are. Okay, we're three levels from where we started, and I don't think we're gonna get it all all back. But that's okay. That's all right. We did our best. are gonna need more seeds. What kind of is that leather? That's leather. We are, we are gonna go ahead and pen in some pigs too. We just can't breed them yet. I will need to go on an adventure sometime soon. Maybe even next episode, because I'm I need to find a village. Like, you know, one of the previous updates. I don't know which one, because this is 1.16. A recent-ish update was village and pillage, and they changed villages. And I've been around them, but I haven't really utilized them in my single player worlds, like, no, okay. Single player as in non-let's play worlds, because you guys are are playing along with me. No, um, I've experimented a bit in my, in my off-camera worlds, but I don't really know how they work. I haven't really utilized them. I know part of the update was all these new blocks, like the loom and the blast furnace, I think. What the heck was that? That's not a normal zombie sound. Oh, it's a drowned, okay. Oh, I do not like those sound- Oh! Oh, I do not like those sound effects at all. That's so gross. Is that another one? Ugh. Yeah, that's the, the other thing. If, if, if you're wondering why sounds keep, like, surprising me so much, you know, I've, I've barely played this game over the past past couple of years. When I have played, I usually play with my sound off. I just play with, like, music or, like, a, a Let's Play or something playing in the background. So, any sound changes are new to me. And I don't think I'd ever actually heard drowns before. That's also why I didn't know the sound of the trident. I was like, what's that, like, clinking noise? Because I did not know they made that sound. It's a cool sound. I just didn't recognize it at all. Let's go ahead and clear this off, and then we're going to go ahead and get some wood, and we'll make some fences. I'm not sure what kind of wood to use. I think I think we'll use dark oak. Not because it looks good, necessarily, for fences, but just because we have a lot of dark oak wood around us, and I haven't really used it for anything. So, why not? Just cut down a couple dark oak trees. In the meantime, though, let's find those cows and get them closer. There's two. I thought there was one closer, though, to where I where I built the pen. Did I kill it? I don't know. Okay, get the wheat. Let's get the moo-moos down. Oh, you're stuck. You are very stuck. Uh, what the heck? They've had, they've had breeding in this game for probably... I, I don't know. I, I can never remember like how far apart updates are in, in real time because my sense of time with this game is distorted because I would go for you know a couple of years playing it nonstop and every update would feel like it took forever and then I would you know go away for a couple of years and so I don't know how long how much the games oh, come on. My point is they've had this in the game for a very long time and it's still awful. I have slime balls, don't I? I should have just made leads. Alright. Come on. No, 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 no. Come here. Come here. Oh. Goodness gracious. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, okay. Ugh. Good grief. Alright, let's go. Uh, how long have I been recording? Alright, let's go eat a dark oak tree or two. And then we will make fences. We'll fence in the cows. I will start a wheat farm. I'll probably fast forward this just because it's already getting a little late in the episode. And then we will go from there. <sighs> this is what you get when you don't pay attention. Don't be absent-minded, kids. You'll regret it. Okay, that's what I wanted. 
All right. Their pen doesn't need to be much bigger than it is now, so we will just kind of wrap this around here. I don't normally use fence gates, I usually use carpets. But since I have 64 of them, I guess I may as well. I guess technically I could have just made it out of all fence gates. I just It'd just be really ugly, is my main thing. Actually, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, oh that was dangerous. No, 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 no. I should have broken the top block first. Or no, I should have broken the bottom block first. Okay. Alright, you two, make nice. Don't mind while I clear brother. Advancement made. The parrots and the bats. Alright, that's nice. Okay. Now that's done. I guess we may as well just... Let's just attach it. Uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six. No, let's not attach it. I want... I want to... Nine, so eleven. So let's see here. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And then... Okay. So now here's what we do. We are going to go get some iron. We're going to make a hoe and some bucket. Actually, I think I already have buckets. Do I already have buckets? I should have buckets. I have buckets! Hooray! Alright, then we just need a hoe. Oh, come on. Thought I'd drop something. And where are the rest of my seeds? That is it. Are you... Okay, there we go. Alright. We're gonna rush, rush, rush through this so I can get this done. And then we're gonna end the episode. And next episode, I think we'll do some exploring. I may do some work off camera. Probably not even work, just like, just hang around a bit so I can uh, make some progress on the farm in terms of like crop growth and uh, population growth, as it were. So, one, two, three, four. Should be the middle. And if we actually start here, we can do this. And then that, 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 and that. And that. Okay. And now, I just take my shield off so I can just do this quickly. Sorry about, sorry about the voice. Awesome. All right. And now we just start planting. And we can use the bones we have. I know I have a ton of bones back at the uh, house. So I may go ahead and use those off camera. All right, so we've got a farm started. And, oh, don't even think about it. Don't even think about it. Not happening. No. Get away. Thank you. And you know what? We've got 8,000 gates. Let's just put one on each side. If you guys have any idea of what I can do with 61 fence gates, please let me know in the comments. Anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoyed. I apologize if this wasn't the most exciting episode, but I just... 
I've got a lot of work to do, guys. I don't know what's going on, but if you have any suggestions as far as enchanting goes, or... Oh, I did drop something. I dropped all that iron. As far as enchanting goes, or as far as defenses, I mean, I'm going to need to make a more secure base, because this is not... This is not safe. And also, anything to look for when I explore, please, please, please let me know in the comments. And we'll go from there. And if you guys have any idea what's going on, please tell me. <sighs> I need help. Anyway, guys, hope you all enjoyed. This is Dr. Bacon, and I will see you all later.